Okay, seedlings, you see the sun's come up. Let's go see what our kids accomplished. All right, so we sent... Remember we sent her... Which one is this? Purple hair, this is Fox. We only sent Fox with the fishing pole. Now he still came back with... Came back with fish. But he still came back with some general goods. Okay? And so we sent... Him only with the pickaxe. See, it's like... I don't know. It doesn't look like it had much effect on what they brought back. So this person did bring back mostly fruits and veg. So I'm guessing this was... I can see a camera. She was in Vale. And so this is Ember. Ember only had the sword. And see, she did not bring back anything related to sorting. Nobody brought back any monster goods. So... But at least we got bail experience up. So now we're getting two star stuff. So everybody's getting better at what they're doing. And I don't think it's hurting anything by having them out. Now they're got, not getting any experience in here. Which I'm too worried about. So. Okay, so, so let's go. Fox is Metal Fields. And she's got two stars on there. So it doesn't seem like it matters what we send them with. So I'm only going to send them... Now let's just do it this way. We're going to send them all with nothing. Can I send them with a double pickaxe? No, can't send them with a double pickaxe. All right, so I'm only going to send, I'm going to send all three of them with nothing but pickaxes. How's that sound? What happens if we send them all? All right, so Ember. And how come, all right, so Ember. Pickaxe. Now how come she can't begin gathering? Hmm. Interesting question, my dear friends. Maybe we've been wrong about this the whole time. Maybe it's a display bug. Maybe we can't send them with... Let's do this. So if I, can I give her a sword? So how come she can't go gathering at the moment? Why can she not go gathering? Because we haven't selected a destination. Because I'm an idiot, that's why. Here I was getting ready to accuse the developers of another book. It was just me, because I'm an idiot. All right, so he's got the pickaxe, she's got the pickaxe. He's going to have the pickaxe. We got pickaxes out the wazoo. All right, there we go. Begin that gathering, kids. So now it's another 24 hours and you just need to wait for them. So I think it's time for... So we had our lettuce. What did we need our lettuce for? for? The gardening skill, right? Gardening is... Here's our gardening. We need gardening for never rot. So we got our lettuce. We need a two-star lettuce, which we have. We need two-star parsley. Oh my... Biscuits. Now we need some stinking parsley, and we can't grow parsley. All right, let's go see. Let's go see this person. Let's go have a chat with this person. And we need to go check on our... We need to go see Marsh Tit, anyway, to check on our pumpkins. I'm sure our pumpkins are doing fine, but we want to make sure that Marsh Tit hasn't taken them. There's our fish, there's our new fancy fish scanner, which doesn't seem to... What, wait, where's our fish scanner? Uh, hello? Does the fish scanner not work during the daytime? Does it only show fish that you can't normally see? That seems like a bunch of hooey to me. Alright, Twanging Gardens. Is this where we need to be? Yeah, Marsh Tits here. RB, I'm pressing my RB. I know what my RB is, baby. The pink rose. So I guess the fish scanner only works at night. Let's see if we can look and... Let's check and see if that's what the skill says. Look, see, I clicked on the wrong screen again. Fishing. Press F to scan for nearby. It was, it was RB. It was RB. I've got the... They're doing that thing again. Capital F. Alright, so maybe it only works at night. 
guess what we know. I guess if you can see the fish, you don't really need it, but still. We'll go ahead and turn these in so I don't accidentally give them to somebody. And so there's that. 21 parsley, so we needed. We still need two parsley. I have no idea where it even would have went and gone to. Alright, so we need two more parsley. So where does it say parsley grows? We don't need a stinking book, you idiot. Sorry, being hard on myself, aren't I? That's what she said. Alright, parsley. Whole eight long weeks, morning sun, or for the, so I'm guessing summer, morning sun for the whole of eight long weeks. Here's from head. So, first week of spring. Well, it is spring, so we should be able to find parsley somewhere. Well, what do you know? Our long quest has ended. Our long quest. I can't believe we made it. I remember. Man, this part here was the toughest part when we walked here. I remember here when Bill lost his shoe? And then we got over here and we found it and like everybody was like, we're never going to find it. And then the and then the note from the scroll from the guy that was in the moon. Um, the oracle that was in the moon. Sorry, that's from my book. The oracle in the moon said just look north of the, of the catnip to find what you seek. And there it was. All right, so let's give Marsh Tit. His last two bits of parsley. Alright, so now we've completed another skill, my dear friends. So now we're immune to brownie curses. You must be careful when it comes to the business, nay, the art of gardening. It can be a dangerous um business. And I'm not just talking of, and I'm not just talking of turnips that suddenly become sentient and decide to attack you for all the times you made fun of their rude shapes. You could easily have your heart broken, as I did in my youth. It was a beautiful cabbage. She was. It was a beautiful cabbage. She was, full voluptuous leaves, pale as green moonlight. We were so happy until she started running with a gang of sprouts. They were never. Things were never the same after that. Deep lore in this game. And so vegetables give seeds when cut down while ripe. Okay, that's a nice one. That seems like. I mean, that's like gardening 101. Even I could do that when I had my own gardens back when I lived in the country. <laughs> back when I lived in the country, even I could get my own stuff, so. I'm going to go ahead and turn in stuff, so we can't even turn in. So we'll have to turn in our five-star leeks. And then our sunflowers have to be three-star sunflowers. Luckily, we were able to steal all the sunflowers we needed. All right, so now tomatoes. We just need 12 three-star tomatoes. All right, so just so it won't be too long before we can do that one. And, and plant seeds in all seasons. That's a nice one. So that needs three-star grapes. I'm just going to turn in our three-star stuff at the moment. Night berries. We don't have any three-star night berries. Songstro flowers. We have plenty of songstro flowers. We don't have any use for them, really. Other than questing. Three star turnips. I don't even know where those came from. Alright, so can plant seeds in all seasons. Tasty. Add one star to planted crops. There's more pumpkins. So this one shouldn't be... Well, I don't know. His marshmallows are hard to come by. So. Alright, so we're moving right along. In obtaining our next tier of skills. Hey, I clicked on the right screen. The right button twice. We got fishing. We know what our next tier of fishing is. We know what our next tier of cooking is. We know what our next tier of this nonsense is, which is going to take forever and a year to get, just like this. And then exploration. Whistle roots. Oh, we didn't forget. That's why we need to check if that's always when for after midnight to look for the whistle roots. But we still have no idea where to get this golden apple. What's it called? The Silver Knox. The Dugger Knot. So we need that for a knocker. I mean, that's important. We need to... I have no idea where it would come from unless it comes from... The Void. Dugger Knot. So we got a long way to go before we're ready for this. Little Saps. Rosa Romance. So she is just... I guess she's just in-game stuff. We're not too far away from... Getting our next Hootenanny. 
Ebbstone Sickle. Okay, so let's go check on our pumpkins. Apothecary is getting to perk point. As her pumpkins are still growing. Do we have any more pumpkin seeds? Nope. I don't think we need to water them again, but we'll go ahead since they're in the... Right, everything looks good as far as the watering goes. So let's go check on the old shoppies. Apothecary getting to perk point, but I don't think I need to do anything with it. Right, the Candlewitch Village and Dunford. I don't know which shop just got a... I don't know which shop just got their delivery. Let's see how things are going up here. Now, it seems like there's not quite as many people here. But we still made 301 gold yesterday. Here, it went brass. Okay, so we got some... So, it seems like we have less orders, maybe? I don't know. Blacksmith's level still going up. Holly can see some people just don't gain any blacksmith skill. And I don't understand. We got two perk points here. We got a long way to go before we get our next premium box is what we need next. That's what I'm shooting for next. Guess we don't need to do this. Crafting successive source. So I never even saw that wool. I never even saw that helping. Will or increase its yield by plus one. I never saw that. We were never getting plus three, plus four, plus five. Swords, hammers, and wards with quill ore. Kill 10 enemies to increase how long customers will wait to be served for the day. Does that mean we have to kill 10 enemies each day? Once per season, gift three identical four star weapons in a row to trigger a fad event. Staff with type 100% tip on one of for sales. Let's test this. Alright, so we can do wards. With quill ore. Let's the wards with quill ore, which is any of the normal ore. So we got plenty of so we can do um so let's do some wards successive. Let's get rid of all of our thirteen. Alright, so this is number one. This is number one. And those bars that I mean like I said, let's see we're just using normal so we got plenty of hits on this tamale. Don't ask me where the word tamale came from. I have no idea. <laughs> Did have Mexican food last night, but I didn't have any tamales. I don't think anybody at the table had Mexican. Reminds me I need to do my Duolingo for the day. Okay, there's that. Now see, from what I understand, if your durability is max, it adds a star to it. All right, so there's, so I guess I made that little, All right, so there's our one zinc wards. That's going to the shelf. Okay, so let's make another zinc ward with one star. Did we get double that time? We were supposed to get double on everything. I don't think it gave us double. But I don't know. It doesn't show us like it does with the other thing. Okay, so this will be number two. So this should be four. Got four of these wards now. I guess I should have made sure that there wasn't already any up there. Not doing too hot on here, but more hits makes it easy this is two so this should be four wards there we go they're building max the shelf that should be four and then here this will be six i mean the wards are easy to make and i guess since it's, for whatever reason that counts towards count as weapons I guess anything that's for dungeoneering. We can't use a hammer for a weapon, can we? I just have no... Well, I guess the utensils don't have any in-game use either. So I guess, oops. Uh-oh. This isn't going to be a good one. They get really good here. So we're not going to get our bonus quality star for this one. That's okay. Yeah, two shelf. So that should be six. Ward. Craft. I have no idea if this does anything. It doesn't add anything to toughness. Yeah, it adds a little bit to the toughness, but I don't know if it's... If you do it too long, if it gets bad or what. What's that? Let's do this. Just don't get me talking too much and I won't miss. There we go. 
circles are all about the same size. I wonder if there's something that'll make the circles bigger. Or if, it's, or if that's just random. It could be accuracy. I'm guessing that would be your accuracy stat that would determine. Alright, so look. Alright, so there we go. Alright, look. So, okay. I'm an idiot. So there, we got four of them that time. We got four of them. Alright, so let's keep going. And so now it says it. Now it says it's ink war times four. I swear to I swear to whoever that it didn't do that before. But you know I have bad. I got bad eyes. I'm just an old man. I'm no spring chicken anymore. But if we can make. But if we can get up to like let's see, how many possible wards can we make? Does he, so I know it's something we can test. Wards, the charms count too? I don't know. Why aren't you answering me? People ask you questions all the time. You never answer me. I can hear just fine. All right, so let's see what this is. Durability max. So we still got four that time. So I'm wondering if double is the most you can get. We got our two and our two and our two. Let's keep going. Keep going. Let's just keep going. And we can just make so much. It'd be the Ward Emporium. We can control the Ward District. What are the marking on these deep zinc wards? Are we using zinc or tin? I don't know. If we get anything else, it doubles them in, so... There we go. That one took longer than normal. What's the most zinc wards we can get? Their ability max. And so we got four again. Okay, so let's go into the shelf. We'll do a couple more times just to see. I mean, it's double the most we can get. We get two from our normal and double from the thing. So but I guess I can't complain. If I can make four swords or four charms or four utensils or four hammers at a time. Oops, that wasn't a good one, was it? Look at all those perfects in a row. Alright, so here we go. And this will be the last one. Oops. Did we get max? Still got max. Alright, so we still just got four. So I'm thinking... Alright, let's do one more. I can't stop. The shelf... I mean, this is a hundred... A hundred brass at a time, I'm guessing. And if these each sell for 25 each, which they should easily, then that's good money, you know? Free real estate. There you go. My old arm's getting tired from mashing these buttons. 55. And here we go. Beautiful. Another one maxed out. Alright, so I'm guessing four is going to be the max, which I can't complain. I mean, I guess it can't just let me make a hundred of them at a time. So where's our wards? Alright, so we got 20 wards to sell. 20 wards. Now, here's something I wonder. Does this count for all... I'm going to take these. Alright, so we got all this junk. I'm going to take this to the other one. So, I don't share. Look at all those orders. Sure, we don't really have that many orders all coming in. Materials, I'm going to go ahead and drop off. We got everything here. Alright, so, I got everything else. Alright, so, today, have we sold any of our zinc wards yet? Oh, we've sold two zinc wards so far. 40 each. So that's 20. And we're getting two reps. So that's 20 each. So each one of those. So we got 20 still. So that's 20 times 4. I'm sorry. 20 times 20. We still have 400 there. Okay. So I want to check on the old inventory stitch. The shops don't share inventory, right? I'm just going to go and double check on our other shop. 
going to be 8 p.m. This other shop's probably closed over here in Mellowbrook. The Mellowbrook, br Mellowbrook branch of our empire. They got nothing on there. They got orders. They got some materials. They do have some materials. Right, so, so definitely inventory is not shared between shops. Okay. Inventory is not shared between shops, so we're going to order. Order. And go ahead and, and go ahead and max it out. Order a little bit of everything. And I wish we could just tell it. Give me one with everything. 197 for zinc, so we're just going to blow through all of our money. And iron ore. Oh. They even after ordering, even after fully stocking this shop, we've still got plenty to go. Now yesterday, still today, Alright, so we. Alright, so this shop is already making good money. I mean, it's been three days or so, so we're already making good money. Star Sapphire, of course, we had a good squad here. We got a good squad. Hate to lose them. Two perk points, so now we've got metal fields in the Vale. Make us Summer Down. Metal fields, Vale, Summer Down, and Woe Marsh. In that order. What was this one? This is that random war. Now, this could be like, the War on the Rock is a high yield one mine. The War Mine will match the quality of the highest quality tool weapon you sold the previous day. Okay. Thanks. Oh, we need to check on the old apothecary, too. We have to check on that, because they got a perk point. I don't know if that perk point is going to be something we need to worry about. Something that's going to do us any major good. We need to order them some supplies, too. I don't know if it's making much money for us, but it, everything is more reputation, right? It's all about that reputation. So today, 149, so they're making good profit. His apothecary level is just absolutely not going up, though. We have two perk points. What was I going to do? Apothecary premium box, or... So do we want to order rare items, or do we want to order... Or high quality items. I think we'll do this one. So we can order the rare items. Larger selection of rare items. Okay, so let's see what we can order now. Oops. Order materials. I don't know which ones are the... So we don't have any... Alright, we got some pretty good selection of ingredients at the moment. But, you know, I don't know which ones are the rare ones. Let's see. All right, so good. It tells us what we have in stock, what we don't have in stock. Okay, so cuck oops. So cuckoo do normal box. Parsley, we already have parsley. Time, normal box. I think normal box means that there'll be two stars. I think that's what that means. So get him maxed out. It maxed out. I mean, everything's about the reputation, right? If he can't sell something because he doesn't have the ingredients, then that's reputation that we've lost out on. And we can always use ginger in our recipes. Bog beans. Garlic. I don't know if our shop can even hold this much stuff. Guess we'll find out though, won't we? Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and order, what was it, Spearwort, we only had two of those. Vial of Slims, we got all the Slim we need. Alright, that's good. And then I guess we'll take a peek at the other shop. Nighttime, yes, the shop is closed. Even I let my workers have the night off. So this one made 327, so we're doing great. What did we sell just today? An apple, cabbage, gooseberries, grapes. So 
Everything's selling. We're making good reputation. Hundred and seven. See, even just the tips is paying for everything. But we don't have any perks here waiting for us, do we? We got one perk point. Oh, we got lots of perk points here. This shop isn't growing as fast as the other ones in terms of reputation, though. I wonder what Tier Nanog unlocks before Mellow Fields. That's weird. You would have the Fae coming to your shop before. I don't want them selling me anything. I don't need a random gift. Need the better selection of items and good store premium box would be nice. But yeah, we're getting there. We have plenty of stock at the moment. Don't have any gooseberries. I mean rabbit corn dolls. Maybe that's why there's not so many children around. Right? Oh, we got plenty of grapes. Moxie. Okay, so we're gonna have a little bit of everything. Can we have to do it like this? Nope. The balls aren't selling. How can we order a dog to sell? I guess we could put one of our dogs up for sale, which seems kind of rude. Unless we captured one. Can we capture a wild dog? Can we lure a dog? If we run into a dog out in the wild, can we lure it? Let's do lure it to a new owner. Okay, let's head home and see if the kids are going to be home soon. And so another productive day. Just waiting on our pumpkins to grow. Our next level of skills are going to be a bit harder to come by, though. So, But our shops are going to help out with that a lot. I mean, eventually, I guess, I mean, eventually you'll get to the point where your shops can you get all the stuff you need for your quest. You can just order it, right? How's the whistle root situation? Is it up here? And so there it is. You can't get it until after midnight. Let's get over here and bump it up to midnight real quick. It's raining again. How you like them apples? Blah, blah, bling, blah, 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 bling, 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 bling. I used to be able to play Heart of Brahms Lullaby on the piano. During COVID, I spent a long time learning how to play the piano. And now that COVID's over, all my abilities in that realm are gone. So where are we going? Going this way. Is our whistle we're ready to go? There it is. So now we have two whistle roots. Now we just need. Now will it grow every midnight or does it only grow on. And all this does is give us this thinking campfire. Either way, I'm not going to complain too much. So rainbow, so we need. We've already given her two. Okay, we've given her two. And we have two in our pocket. We only need one more. We need one more to get that. Okay, so let's go get the kids home. Doesn't matter what time of day it is anymore. I'm an adult. I can stay up as late as I want and go to bed when I want. So last thing I got home at like 8 last time. So let's go sleep until morning. Just the way I save our wristle, wristle root. So there we go. So we gave them all nothing but pickaxes this time. All they have is the pickaxes. Let's see, they brought home, now see, she brought home more. So I brought home a little bit of everything. We brought home the most zinc ore. Or he, I don't know which one it is. Now, they all level up. Maximum star rating increased, good. 10 and 10. Basil, Cuckoo Doo, Cuckoo Doo and Primrose. Very good. Summer down experience, going up. We got some good copper. All right, so... So just giving them, so they're still always going to bring home something, but they'll bring home more of what. So that is, so that's our theory. Okay, so now. He was metal fields. Now all we're going to give them is the fishing pole. Okay, all you get is a fishing pole. We're going to see how things go with nothing but a fishing pole. And look at that three-star quality. 
Now, remember, I just had these. I just, just, I just bought. I just adapt, ad adapted. I just adapted these kids recently. So it's not like they have. It's not like I've been spending weeks and weeks and weeks gathering, you know, improving their strength and stuff like that. So we're getting up to three star pig auction today. Pig auction, so we can finally get some pigs. So that's what we'll do in the next episode. We'll get some pigs. So I'll sleep and save, and we'll get some pigs in the next episode. Thank you for being here, my dear friends.